Now, can you just imagine today if you are told somebody has disrupted our supply chain infrastructure in Mombasa, what would happen? And for that reason, then, the next intervention that uh, we uh, are trying to put in place is the establishment of the strategic petroleum reserves. You have seen in the initially proposed draft regulations uh, that the strategic petroleum reserves fund is going to be created to support uh, the National Oil Corporation to undertake the mandate of guaranteeing security of supply of petroleum products into the country. And I, I believe that once those things are put in place, uh, then we should be in a better place to talk about predictability and how we can, in an agile format, manage our environment. I think I will end my few comments there. And just to ask my colleague from the Kenya Pipeline Company to stand up and wave. And I hand over back to Governor Nderitu. Well, thank you, CEO. Let's appreciate Governor once more. Uh, thank you. Thank you very much, uh, Your Excellency. I should um, also recognize in the, in the House uh, the Honorable Shabal uh, from Mpigeni uh, Makofi from Mbasa. Uh, Sylvester Kasuku is in the House, a former MD of Lapset uh, and policy advisor. I, I wondered, Prime Minister, if you, I shouldn't really ask Dr. Masharia to even say Jumbo before we invite you. So, Dr. Masharia, you know he is the one who moves the product on, <laughs> on most of our behalf. I think you better just come, Dr. Tari, if, if to only say hello, and then we invite uh, the Prime Minister. Your Excellence, the Right Honorable Raila Molodinga, I would like also to appreciate my Governor of Lakipa, His Excellency Nderito, that's why he's harassing me. <laughs> Let me appreciate also the aspirant for Mombasa Governorship, uh, Shabal. I think he's also seated here as an investor in Gulf Power, Gulf Energy, ETC. Colleagues, good afternoon. good afternoon. The only thing I can assure Your Excellence is that Kenya Pipeline is full of product. I don't know where to take it. <laughs> As we sit here, I have 200 million liters of PMS. I have 160 million liters of diesel. And I have 60 million liters of jet seated. I have a Shirami who is seated in front of you delivering 120 uh, million liters of pe uh, super petrol. Then I have a vessel which is uh, also waiting to deliver jet, 120 million, in about two days. Then Ashrami comes back to deliver another 120 million of super. I don't know where to take it if we don't resolve this matter. So KPC, we are so wet. The country has all the product it requires for the next one and a half months before I receive anything else. Thank you. <laughs>